In this legal series, we are going to present the importance of heritage sites. Importance of the heritage sites should be felt by every citizen worldwide because most heritage sites are in danger due to various reasons among which overwhelming tourism and overdevelopment and rising sea level due to change of the climate. So we have to be concerned about the heritage problems. The heritage sites are protected to remember what our past, humankind past, the how our old people preserved the, the sites very carefully. In this week, the UNESCO, part of the UNO, has issued the concern for the heritage sites, destruction or in danger in Venice of Italy. The UNESCO is much concerned about the really heritage site in Venice. The UNESCO Heritage Committee, which gathered and advised to the Italian government to protect these in the Venice sites. A long-term preservation of this heritage site is a necessity of the time. Same thing, I have to mention here the Tamil Nadu Heritage Commission Act. The Tamil Nadu Heritage Commission Act has been enacted in 2012 and suit within the needs of the preservation of the heritage sites in worldwide. Like Italy, in the states of the India also, many heritage sites are in danger. Recently, in two places in Tamil Nadu, the archaeological department of India has unearthed more things. One is Adi Chanalur, Another one is Kheledi in Madurai. Like that, these have to be preserved. We should not allow the heritage sites to go to the debris, to the danger sites, which can't be recovered at any cost to the old glories of the heritage. That is important. So in suit with really UNESCO, what the Tamil Nadu government has done in it, the Tamil Nadu government has enacted this Tamil Nadu Heritage Commission Act 2012. How this act is helpful to the people to preserve the really heritage site. The commission advised to the government for the classification of the building and also preservation of the building as well as alteration, modification and uh, usage of the buildings and anything. So like that, it has nearly above yet 10 functions, about 10 functions. The commission advised to the government in preservation of the heritage site, also the protection of the heritage site to the government. So like that, in India, overall 40 heritage sites are existing. Those have to be preserved. Those have to be preserved. We have to go those heritage sites. The people have to be given some the awareness on it, how this can be preserved, so that the act can be made much effective. Much effective. Heritage is not an easy one. Due to Ukraine, Russia war, a most heritage site in the Ukraine in danger. In danger. Those are going to be enlisted, which are the heritage sites in Ukraine are in danger. So, as a citizen of this India, we have to honor this act, the Heritage Commission Act 2012. The Tamil Nadu government has done well. But we have to be also helpful to preserve this heritage site. If new site is found, even by the citizen, that the importance can be given to it. So it will be brought under the act and uh, we can preserve it. Thank you.